After a journey of some 15,000 kilometers, this will be Tsung Cheng Fa's home for the next couple of days. At first we were in a big hotel, but I didn't want to stay there. I want a more authentic experience of how things are here on campus. Tsung Chen Fa is accompanying his granddaughter for the start of her studies. He's here together with her mother, who's off running last-minute errands. The start of semester means hotels near the university are often fully booked. To deal with the visitor numbers, for the past few years, the University of Tianjin in northern China has been pitching tents as an alternative and free accommodation. Parents want to be there when their children enroll. Of course, the students can actually take care of everything on their own. They don't need their parents' support. But parents want to be there. They're happy to be able to be part of their children's first steps on campus. Tsung Cheng Fa is being picked up by his granddaughter for a quick tour of the campus. Sun Kesin is taking mathematics. She's part of China's one-child generation. Like other only children, she's the sole focus of attention for the adults in the family. My mother and grandfather are coming along because they want to get an impression of the surroundings, of my fellow students and my teachers. But that doesn't mean that they don't trust me. They know I can take care of things by myself. More parents and grandparents turn up at the gym hall. Altogether, the university has put up 800 tents. At the moment, not all of them are occupied. But Tsung hopes that more parents will come. The more people that are here, the merrier it is. We Chinese love being in big groups. It's really nice. Tsung is getting ready for his first night on campus. The prospect, it seems, is almost as exciting as it is for his granddaughter.